laptop chair downtime as always i'm starting from the bottom side of this laptop and we've got a total of 13 phillips screws to remove nothing wild here but there are two very important things you need to know first one hidden screw alert there are three sneaky screws hiding under the rubber cups make sure to peel those off so you don't miss them second screw size matters mark your screws the ones on the rear side are longer than the front ones. I've seen way too many laptops where someone jammed a long screw into the front and boom, you end up with an ugly bump on the palm rest. Not cute at all. Also, the front right side screw is a bit thicker than other three up front, so make sure the one goes back exactly where it came from. If you mix it up, you could strip the mount or even crack the palm rest. Once all screws are out, the bottom case popped off like a butter, thanks to my trusty plastic pry tool. No surprises here. Battery swap, super easy. Just a couple Phillips screws and it's out. But very important, this ASUS design has a security clip on the battery connector. Slide it out first before unplugging anything. I've seen way too many boards wrecked because someone yanked the connector without unlocking the clip. Don't be that guy, please. Upgrade and internals. There is one SSD installed, but also an extra M2 slot for upgrades. Motherboard comes with a 16GB of RAM soldered, but there is an empty RAM slot for an expansion. Wi-Fi card, it is removable, and a massive cooling system keeps everything chill. Very important thermal tape. If you're cleaning or replacing the heatsink, don't forget to reapply thermal paste. Your CPU and GPU will thank you for it. Warranty warning. Asus gaming laptops come with security stickers. One on the battery screw, another one on the heatsink screw. If you break those while the laptop is still under warranty, well, kiss that warranty goodbye. Also, all external ports are directly soldered to the motherboard, so if any of them go back, repairs can get real expensive. And that's it for today. Love and peace to everybody.